Treasurer Schiller, why are you putting out this call for help from Columbus and the General Assembly? Honestly, we hear people and we want to help and we're limited by Columbus, and so the action needs to take place in Columbus. That's Hamilton County Treasurer Jill Schiller, the elected official responsible for issuing property tax bills to the owners of the 350,000 parcels countywide. Wednesday, she put out a call to state lawmakers in the General Assembly to fix Ohio's property tax system. It comes after tax bills began landing in mailboxes across the county, causing sticker shock for many homeowners who saw increases of thousands of dollars, some almost double from last year. Schiller says fixing the state's education funding system, which still gets 60 percent of its revenues from local property taxes, would help. State lawmakers Dunny Isaacson and Cecil Thomas both agreed the system needs to change. What can be done in Columbus to do that? We rely way too much on our property taxes to do the heavy lifting for us in terms of revenue generation. And if we were serious about delivering for people in Ohio on the challenges they're actually facing, we would be serious about reducing their property tax burdens, especially for those hardest hit. Thomas points out Ohio is sitting on a $5.7 billion surplus, which he says is because the state stopped major funding for local governments about 15 years ago. That money is for when we're in a crisis. And Ohio is in a crisis at this point. People can't put on any more tax levies to try to cover some of this, their, their, their basic expenses and put that on the backs of the citizens. Thanks for checking out Local 12's YouTube channel. Click the links and hit subscribe so you can be notified anytime we post new stories.